Expert Pack. On this quick video, we will show you Kernel Pack, that is our newest tool and how it works. So let's begin. Kernel Pack is a multifunctional rootkit with an advanced C2 command and control platform that helps you configure, interact, set up and deploy your own rootkits. You can stay silent with kernel level process hiding, disable event traces, bypass AMSI and patch guard, escalate to PPL and much more. A rootkit is a stealthy type of software, typically malicious, designed to hide the existence of certain processes or programs from normal methods for detection and enable continued privileged access to a computer. As you first open Kernel Pack, on the middle of the screen, you can already see the features you can use within your rootkit, such as process hiding, driver hiding, credential stamping, auto execution, file hiding, privilege escalation, and much more. And to make it simpler and easier, once you connect to your rootkit in the rootkit remote console, you will also see a command list and a quick help. How to start using Kernel Pack? After you have your Kernel Pack up and running, simply go to Remote Control and select Rootkit Wizard. Select your IP address, port number, by default we will use 8000, and your rootkit type. Then lastly, if this rootkit will be executed into an EDR-enabled environment, we recommend to select User Level and Hooker feature. So before mapping the rootkit into memory, all the hooks from the EDR will be temporarily removed. And last, you have to select your loading method. It could be local exploit or manual. Local exploit will attempt to load the rootkit using vulnerable drivers. This way we can bypass certain protections. But if that fails in your environment, you can always use manual load. Select here your preference and then click on Generate. There, you will be asked for a name for the SIM bundle. Save it somewhere you can access and copy the rootkit to your target. Here, as it's shown in the video, I have selected Local Exploit, so I will load the rootkit using an exploit. Double-click the rootkit loader and right after that, you should hear New Agent Connected, coming from your kernel pack. In the video, the kernel pack client executable that is running with user-level privileges but interacting with the rootkit, the driver itself using IOCTL functions. This user-level PID in the video has been escalated to system using the driver, of course. So there you go, your own rootkit with a graphical interface and easy to use. Thanks for watching and see you on the next video.